so basically it auditing is certainly a future you know someone is saying in the chat that it is a future and i completely agree with you that it auditing is the future it is the present and it is the future so nowadays you know there are so many it organizations you know so many it organizations you see uh you know like google apple facebook right different organizations you see everywhere but you know what all these organizations are keeping customers important data right they are they are having lot of they, they do lot of transactions they keep data right and they have lot of servers lot of machines available so now when all these organization let's say this is organization 1 this is organization 2 right so when when we have so many different organizations and so many organizations are keeping data there are possibilities that these organization might be selling the data to someone else right have you heard this news somewhere that that organization has tried to sell the data of the customer is anyone i mean did anyone hear this news any time in the past that organization is trying to sell the data have you heard about uber or some other organization so when that happens right all these customer customer data can be very helpful for other organization let's say uh you know if their uber is an organization and it has a customer data the people who who travels you know every day you know there there is a customer data what uber has and that customer data uber is having that data because a lot of people are using uber app today but this particular data can also be very helpful to someone else maybe to facebook to show some relevant ads right maybe to some other advertisers right maybe yes to bolt or to someone else right this data can be very useful so what uber can do uber can sell, sell this personal data to other organizations now at this point of time the personal information of an organ of of the user is being sold to someone else which is not correct at all so how many of you over here in this room today think that selling the data of pers or selling the personal data is not right how many of you think that is not right can anyone tell me how many of you thinks that's not right so yes so that is not right at all right if if organization is trying to sell the data to the to other organizations right that's incorrect that's not right this is one case second case let's say that there is an employee okay there is an employee this employee is leaving the organization okay this employee is leaving the organization so you guys might have worked in the past for an organization so whenever you leave the organization you have to submit the laptop your account gets deleted right your uh, your information from the from all the important uh you know uh, let's say that there there is a laptop right you have to submit the laptop and uh there is a information in lot of places that that needs to be deleted right let's say if you uh if you have access to the office st still after you will have left the organization but you still have the access that's wrong so all these things right needs to be audited properly okay let's say that if the organization is not misusing the data or if the employee who is leaving the organization whether the employee is being offboarded properly or not right all this information needs to be audited timely if organizations are not auditing it it can really create a very big problem okay it can really create let's say there is an ex employee there is a former employee okay who still have the access to the email okay there is a former there is a former employee who still have the access to the email of this organization 
he has the complete access which means he can misuse it he can do something wrong with it now this is the big loss for an organization isn't it guys so imagine uh imagine there is a guy uh his name is john he is working for this organization a this is the organization and john is working for organization a but if organization or oh sorry if john leaves this organization right but after 2 years he finds out that he still have access to organization's building and even he has access to the email of the old organization or the previous organization can he misuse it or not how many of you in the chat think or how many of you in the audience think that this is not right can you guys please tell me right this is not right if john is still able to access the email john is still able to enter into the building right that's not right now imagine this is a story only for one employee imagine there are 1 million people who are working in the same organization do you really think it's easy to you know it it is easy to check whether all the people are uh you know off boarded properly or not whether the accounts are deleted or not this is the work for it auditors i mean i'm just giving one example guys but there are multiple such examples available uh where it auditors actually work so i'm just giving you one example that why it auditor are required so now if i read this right it audits assesses an organization security measures to ensure data protection and integrity so i think now this this line makes more sense to people who have joined us that it audits regular it audits are performed to ensure that you know to ensure that data is protected and there is a int integrity which is in place right so that is why nowadays because because these things have been increasing you know you might have heard about these news a lot if you follow you know a lot of cyber security uh, threats or if you follow a lot of uh, you know news or digital world news you will come to know about these that organizations who who do not have it auditors right or the or or, or if the it audit audits are not performed regularly on time they actually fall into big trouble so it auditors actually helps organization to prevent any future problems okay so it auditors are responsible to prevent future threats it auditors are uh, are responsible to audit the firm regularly to find if the data is not uh, is not being sold to someone else or maybe the employee is not accessing it who doesn't have or who shouldn't be having the access to it okay so now it reviews various aspects not just data but also network security you know there are several aspects where it audit auditor actually looks at access control so access control is the same thing what we discussed that the employee who is still having access or not right disaster recovery plans a lot of people know this that when covid happened it was i mean organizations were not prepared you know there were so many organizations which were not at all prepared for covid 19 and with, when it happened lot of organizations suffered millions of lo losses millions of losses but the organization who were actually assessing the risk right who were regularly assessing the risk right they were they were safe they did not lose their millions of dollars because they kept on creating the plan disaster recovery plan that if something goes wrong in future they are ready right so it auditors are also involved in in uh, in assessing the risk okay in uh, assessing the vulnerabilities okay so there there are much more work what it auditors can do apart from that now 
like if you see this that it offers recommendation to address any vulnerabilities weaknesses and compliance issues i think this is this makes really good sense to every one of you here that it's not just about vulnerabilities but organizations may have some weaknesses right they need to find out what are the weaknesses so that they can get it rectified by the concerned teams compliance issues now if if you are in europe i don't know how many of you know, know this that if you are in europe europe follows gdpr right so for organizations have to comply with gdpr policies so if they are not complying with it european governments can actually you know penalized organization and again organization can lose a lot of dollars so it's a it auditor work that they make sure that it actually finds out all the compliance issues on time they actually find out whether the organization is weak or having some weaknesses or not and there are some threats or vulnerabilities which needs to be addressed by the concerned team thank you for watching switch from non it to it today explore www.thinkcloudly.com